Deep Seek version 2.5 is upgraded version that combined the power of Deep Seek version 2 chat and the Deep Seek coder version 2 instruct integrates the general and the coding ability of the two previous version resulting a very underrated and awesome open source model unfortunately because what is happening with the reflection model this model actually went under radar there is not a lot of people speaking and talking about it even if it deserves to be an actual hype the capability of this model after i test it it's fantastic in terms of coding capability it's very good and you're gonna see this in terms of general ability it's decent on a bar with lamas 3.17 tb in evil plus leaderboard deep sync coder version 2 instruct actually rank number two behind gbt4 turbo which make it one of the best open source model currently for coding. For information about this model, it's 236 billion parameters. It have 133 gigabytes, so it's a big chunk of model. It's two model did fusion, so of course it's gonna be a big chunky model. Before we test it out, we should take a look to its benchmark first. I know benchmark no longer mean what it should be because a model like Reflection 70B, which honestly one of the worst model that I ever tested. Here it say in short term, in some area, it's not that good at GPT-4, as you can see here in English general, MT bench, it's not better than GPT-4. In Chinese general, Align bench, it's slightly better than GPT-4. In MMLU, it's not better. In GSM8K, it's slightly better. In MASS, it's far better. We're gonna test this out. And for human evaluation, it's better also. It seems it doesn't say it's the king of anything. It just release another model and it doesn't hype it out or anything. A matter of fact, I feel this model is underrated right now because the stupid situation of reflection model let's test it out and see if this model deserve a better attention from us or not so in order to test this model we're gonna go to the deepseek.com page itself and create an account and then you can actually chat with the coder or chat with the deepseek version 2.5 so i have a list of 12 questions over here three for mass or for logic and the rest for coding. From what I read about this model on Reddit and other places, it's really the best open source model for coding. It's it's basically alternative for ChatGPT or O right now. And if it's true, this will be a great model. So let's start with the mess first. The first model is a complex mess equation and let's see how it will solve it. For the first question answer, the correct answer should be this number 281.2433354. But what I got is actually far wrong. As you can see here, it's 579, which is honestly wrong. But I know this question is not a good start, but trust me, this question actually most of the model get it wrong. It's not an issue over here. My second question is mass, but in natural language. What is 5 to the power of 8 minus 6 to the power of 8? Double it and add 2 to the power of 3. For the second question, minus 2, 5, 7, 7. And the correct answer actually is minus 2, 7, 7. This is perfect for these questions because the reflection model also got it wrong. My third question is a tricky one. It's mass in natural language. I'm asking if 5050 less than 560. As you can see here, it's immediately give me an answer. False. So another question that got it correct. For this question, it's a logic and reasoning. We have five crows on a branch. Three of them fly away. Two come back and three crows joined. How many crows are on the branch? So let's send it out. The correct number should be seven. Yep, that is a perfect. This model so far, it's very, very good. Another question that I got it right. This is a three in the row. Okay. Linda have three sister. Paul have four sister. Can Linda and Paul be sibling? This is for logic and reasoning 
And most of the model get confused when I ask it, especially open source model. It should be true or yes. So Linda and Paul can be said, this is model so far is fantastic. Another question is correct. Another logic and reasoning question. A normal bus is driving at 56 miles per hour. There are three people in the back row and two people in the second to last row. What is the minimum number of people on the bus? It should be six. You just have to add the driver and we will have six. All right. Okay. Okay. This is fantastic. I thought it's going to get it wrong. This is the logic of this model and how it's processed. It. It's fantastic. Like as you can see here, total number of people mentioned is five people, including the driver. All right. Just to add one number, passenger and the driver, six, which is a correct number also. So I asked it a stupid questions from the stupid model that we tested this week, the reflection. I asked it, how many R's, capital R's, are in strawberry? And it got me zero, which is kind of correct. Let's switch it out to small. So I switched it to small R. It didn't get the correct answer, but reflection itself, the reflection model itself, I think it got trained on this model and hard coded in it to give you a correct answer. So I fail here, which is not a problem. This model is doing so good so far. For my final question that about logic, here I ask it, what is the number that rhyme with the word we use to describe a tall planet? And it gave me corn, which is described at all planet is four. Actually, this is correct. It's rhyming corn and four, slightly rhyming. But I try to change it to think about three. What is the number that rhyme with the name of at all planet? Not describing the name. The number that rhyme with the name of tall planet specifically is if I fair and sir. I have no idea why. However, if you are looking for number with rhyming with three, which is what I'm looking for, there isn't a standard number that rhymes perfectly with, with it in English, which is kind of wrong. I have no idea why it failed in that, but let's move on to coding right now. This is a standard question that I ask for every large language model to code a snake game using by game. Even if this model have been asked too many times right now, some models still get it wrong, like the reflection. So this is the code for the snake the game that I requested to create. And so far, it's the longest snake game code that I, I have ever seen from a model. So I'm pretty sure it will work. Yeah. And I like the background also. And there is a smooth in the animation, how it moves and the food is correct. Okay, for some reason I lost, I don't know why. Here it have option, C to play again or Q to quit, let's play again. Okay, it's eating code, everything is fine so far. Yeah, it's, it's perfect. This is a perfect snake game. Like, I like the how we code it. The snake is growing. Actually, this is kind of fun, honestly. Okay, that's enough. Let's go back to coding. It not only succeeded in making this code, it's actually kind of impressive how it created such detailed code with button to click to replay again and the background and everything is functional as it should be. This is impressive. For upcoming questions, I'm asking to create a landing page for an app. The landing page should have five section header about app feature download and contact us. I ask it to make design creative and modern using Tailwind CSS for styling along with HTML and JavaScript. So let's send it out and wait to see how the code will turn to be. Guys, this is the look of the page that I requested. It's super good. Like there is drop shadows, there are gradient colors. Contact us doesn't look like it's made by a beginner developer. Colors is fantastic, purple and black and white. It even gave me con images here. I can ask it to switch it to a placeholder. And here there is drop shadow. and It's fantastic. The style of this page is super good. Another coding question, right? The game of life using Bygame and Bison. One of the coolest stuff that it's doing without asking is explaining each block of code without asking. It have been doing this since creating the snake game. It's finished. After it's finished, it explain and try to break it apart 
in points as you can he see here initialization grid initialization drawing grid update function and main game loop and how to run the game it's fantastic as you can see here it also even tell me what the controller for these games so here it allow me to use this grid to put here the code basically for the game but when I click start using space part, basically delete itself. I have no idea why, but it kind of function, but not function. So what I did is went back and explained the entire game of life to it in detailed and tell it what the purpose of it. And it generated this code and gave me this game. As you can see here, it's, I know it's sure it's not completely perfect yet. But it's acceptable, it's function, it's work, it understand what I wanted and it created actually. For the last question that I have for coding, it's slightly new for me to ask to any model. Write a make file to convert GBEG images to BNG. And I ask it and it gave me actually this code and it told me what to do with it. And here this is the project for structure, where to put the images that I want to convert and where the output will be. And here it told me how to run it. So this is the result of the code and this is the folder that I have. I had an image here called the grid GBG and the output of it is here grid.bng. So it's another success for this fantastic model. So this is the comparison between DeepSig version 2.5 and Lamas 3.170B results. As you can see, Lamas 370B is the entire mass questions, all success. Failed in one of the logic and reasoning. Success the actually how many R's in strawberry. Failed in the rhymes also. Failed on the make file convert GBG image to BNG code. But in the rest, it's successful as you can see here. He failed on three. Also deep seek failed on three. It's almost both of them on the same bar. But deep seek version 2.5 is very good at coding let's take a look to its analysis on artificial analysis.ai in terms of quality it's slightly higher from the lamas 3.1 instruct 7 tb and it's doing great honestly in terms of quality the one bad side that i noticed when i was testing it is the speed of this model it's slightly slower it's acting like a very big large model maybe because it's Two models fused together. In terms of price, it's extremely cheap. The DeepSeek Access ABI actually is like 14 cent or 28 cent for 1 million token, which is impressive. For quality, face output speed and price. The DeepSeek stand in high quality, but in the lower speed tier and pricing. And it's almost acting like one of these chunky big model like Lama 3.1. One four hundred and five billion parameter and uh, Mr. Large, but the edge that it have is its coding capability. And in terms of quality, this price, this box is the most attractive. Basically, it's have a very good quality and low price. There is only three good model over here: the GBT four O Mini and the Lama three point seven TB. And over here, on term of quality, is Deep Sig version two point five. So. We can say, without a doubt, it's one of the most attractive model in terms of rice and high quality. And if you want to access its ABI, it's already exist in the DeepSeek platform. You can have your ABI key here. I'm not sure if this give you a free two dollars and twelve cent for free to test it out, or it's just letting you know when you charge the billing. Not yeah, I think it's not for free, so you have to charge it to use it. I'm gonna try it out myself in terms of ABI and let you know guys in, in a coming video. So my final thoughts about this model, honestly, this model is extremely underrated, to be honest, for an open source model that you can get on Olama over here. Its coding ability is super good for an open source model. It shocked me. To see this high quality and details in generating code, I think that they've said version 2.5 got a bad treatment, just bad luck, because the reflection model fake hype that got generated a few days ago.
And I think this DeepSeek model should be a potential as a new king of open source in just coding in itself. In general ability, it's so similar to the Lama 3.17TB model. The only problem that I can't run it locally, it's a big model, but it's not a problem if you can access for free on the DeepSeek platform itself. Model like this that is open source need our support to get actual hype behind it. So share in tweets about it and try to talk about it with your friend or your community to get a support for this fantastic, awesome model. Have been a blast for me to make this video. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to support my channel by liking and subscribing and hitting the bell notification so you don't miss any upcoming video. This is Hussam Eddin or simply can you call me Sam and see you on the next video.